hi guys this is Kim and welcome to the diva beauty channel today I am gonna do a tutorial using uh, the brand which is called LA colors so yep um this is not the particular product I'm gonna use but I'm gonna use several eyeshadows from them like these a whole lot of eyeshadows looking like these and one specifically looking like this so I went ahead and primed my eyelids already using Jordana's um, eye primer and it's this one that you always see me using in my tutorials that's it so I went ahead and primed my eyelid already. Um, next up, I am going to apply all the bases that I use. And the bases that I use are from LA Colors also. It's the LA Colors Jumbo Pencils. They are similar to NYX Jumbo Pencils. Very creamy. Um yeah that's it these are the ones that I'm gonna use all of these I'll let you guys know in my blog what I use what colors I use so I'm just gonna go ahead and start this tutorial I already did my eyebrows as y'all can see and I already did one eye um, just to speed it ahead okay so I'm gonna go ahead and apply my first base and my first base that I'll be using is the LA Colors Jumbo Crayon in Seashell and I'm going to go ahead and apply that in the tear duct area hope you guys are seeing this And you're gonna blend it out the next base that I'll be using is this one and it's called bikini time and I'll be putting that right in three quarter of the lid After the white base is reapplied, and I'm just gonna blend it out. The next base that I'll be using from LA Colors also is called Tropical Bliss. And put that right after the other light purpley color that I put and the last base that I'll be using is sunglasses and this is a black base and that is going to go on the other corners of our lid and we're just going to blend out any harsh line from these bases okay Next up, I'm going to use this palette from LA Colors and it's called Cafe A Latte, I think. And I'm going to take these two colors, blend it together, the middle color and the 
outer color right here then these two together with a fluffy blending brush and I'm mixing those two together and this is going to go in my brow bone crease area I have hooded eyelids so my crease when I open my eyes my crease don't show that much so what I do is always apply whatever I'm going to apply in my crease on the brow bone this is the part where you can feel the bone you always apply it there because this is going to be like a transition color into my highlight color so there you have it now we're going to take this quad and this is called lemon growth it looks like this and here it is and the color which I'm gonna use is this bright shimmery yellow and I'm gonna take a shader brush and apply this in our tear duct air over the white color. Next color is going to be our purple. And the purple that I'm going to use first is this. This is a quad. And this quad doesn't have a name. But the color on it is CP202. It came in a set. Uh, Set with lipstick and whatnot so this is a quad cp202 and the color that i'm going to use is this purple color right here and this is what i'm going to apply in the as if over that light purple base. now i'm going to take another purple to put on that darker purple base we had and this one is called southern belt and this is the color we're just going to take that and apply on our darker purple base. And this gives like a transition color effect from the lighter purple to the darker purple. And next color which I am going to apply is a black color it's a shimmery gray black color and this is the palette moon rocks and this is the color and I'm just taking a fluffy brush small fluffy brush small crease brush and that is what I'm apply on the outer corners and a little bit in my crease next I am going to take from that first quad that I have and I'm going to take this very light color that's the cafe latte this very light color on that same blending brush And I'm just going to apply this in the inner part of the brow bone. Just blend it in on the inner part. And there you have it. Now we're going to apply our highlight color. And the highlight color that I'll be using is from the Cafe Lottie to um, 6 color eyeshadow little palette whatever you call it and I'm taking this color as highlight now we're going to do our bottom lash line and for the bottom lash line I will be using this purple eye purple base and it's the one that's called tropical bliss so 
I'm just going to pat it on the bottom. And then taking a small shader brush and I'm taking the purple from the Southern Belle and I'm applying that on the bottom lash line. And I'm also going to take a little bit of the black one, the gray black one, and I'm taking that on the outer corner of the bottom lash line, just putting it on the outer corners. Now, we're going to add a concealer. I'm applying a clear concealer. It's just a random clear pencil concealer. Um... And I'm going to apply it on my waterline. There it looks like this. You can use any concealer of your choice. Just to give it that color. And on top of that, I am going to apply NYX Eye Pencil in Sapphire. Next step is we're going to apply our eyeliner and I'll be using Physicians Formula Eyeliner and it's the silver one, the silver packaging. I believe all the black ones almost look the same but they have like different um, shimmers inside of them and this one has like a silver shimmer inside so this is the one that I'll be using to line my lids to make that wing liner effect. I'm going to go ahead and do my face and then I'm going to come back and tell you guys what I use on my face and of course I'm going to do a lip color and all of that after. I went ahead and applied my lashes and did my foundation, blush and contour and I'm going to show you guys what I use for each product on my face. Um, First off, I went in with Black Opal Beautiful Bronze to conceal my hyperpigmentation and blemishes and whatnot. So, this is it. And then for foundation, I use Revlon Fold Ready Foundation. And this one is in Mocha. I don't know if you're going to see the name on it, but... Here it is. Here's the product mocha. And for uh, concealer, I was trying to remember. I used the Revlon Photo Ready in Deep. Looks like this. It's in Deep. And as setting the um the concealer i use the sun tan matte color stain mineral finishing powder under my eyes only and also to set my whole face i use the sun kiss one the revlon photo revlon color stay sorry um sun kiss mineral finishing powder that's it and for highlight, I use the brightening one. Looks like this. And for contour, I use Milani's Brownstone Eyeshadow. And here it is. Oh, it looks like this. And for blush, I use Black Radiant Soft Honey Blush. And here it is. Oh, 
and also I'm trying to remember what else I use because I have so much stuff in front of me for lashes I use the La Charmy 415 number 415 lashes there's some old lashes that I use um, reuse again I like reusing old um, lashes because that's the time when they look better to me um I think that's it for my face so we're gonna go ahead and do the lips and I am gonna use first up it's LA colors lip liner in deepest purple In the middle, I am going to use a LA color, whoa, a LA color lipstick, LA colors lipstick. And this one is called CLIP361. I can show you guys. It looks like this. I'm just going to leave it like this. You can apply a clear gloss over it. Or something with a little glitter. This is the completed makeup look for the LA Colors um, makeup tutorial. So here you have the eyes. And the lips. Um, my lips and my eyes are using LA Colors. My face is different brand of products but don't mind that just mm, this is all about the eyes and the lips and I hope you guys enjoy the tutorial and be sure to check out my blog for more details of all the products that I use in this look and mm, leave comments below or questions below um, and I'll be sure to answer and that's it.